Hello survivors, welcome back to another episode of A Day in a Life of a Broke Player. So today I'm doing the first stage of uh, the state versus state. I'm going to show you what I do. So here what we have to do is to get uh, plasma cores, speed ups and cheap budgets, uh, cheap gear budgets. So I don't have budget. So I'm gonna maybe use a little bit of plasma cores. I have plasma cores for two updates. So I'm gonna do one today and one the other day when plasma cores are required for getting the rewards. So one here and the rest, because you have also, you also have to, yeah, you can use speed ups for, for getting points. So. I'm gonna get the rest of the rewards with uh, by speed up. So I have tons of speed ups here. And um, maybe I'm gonna use some here. Did I get everything? Let's see. Yeah, I'm almost there. I'm gonna train my troops. I'm gonna. 10 days. I should switch to economic talents to upgrade this, but I'm just gonna do my 10 days, seriously. <laughs> Too lazy to switch to, to the talents. Now, I still have, what, 50,000 points to get. Let's see how many speed ups I get. I have a little bit of training. I have tons of speed ups for construction, but and done with construction, so I have to use also plasma core to, to upgrade this. I'm gonna use maybe more plasma cores because I'll be collecting more plasma cores during the days. Maybe I will have uh, 80 for another upgrade, uh, will help me with uh, the other uh, stage. Let's see which research requires the less plasma cores, 26. Yeah, this one. I'm gonna use more speed ups and that should be it guys yeah so I got my three crates here and guys as I told you before you can save all you can to go all out in this event and rank super good but I guess that uh, what most of the spenders do so you are competing with people who are spending tons of money so that if you save a lot maybe you can get a good ranking but i just prefer to go for the safest one and i just make sure to get just enough point to get the three crates so i get my uh, signet uh, reward then because you are getting all these medals so you get all these rewards too uh, there are very good rewards here in the state versus states you get all the crates and you get like legendary hero fragment plasma core bio caps and that's gonna help you to grow as, as a free-to-play player. So that's it. I always make sure to get all my rewards. And then I get a little bit more of resources here. Boom. I need metal, uh, metal. Boom. And I got to get here my advanced relocators because I'm addicted to the advanced relocators so I spend quite uh, a lot of resources here and bio caps. I made a video about how to get free relocators here but you need a lot of resources that's why I'm gathering all the time and I make sure that during a state versus a state I hit some players for resources. Sorry to the players that I hit, but this is the name of the game. Sometimes I get hit and people take my resources. Well, not often, but in the past I used to be <laughs> I used to get hit a lot. I was like zero like four times for resources until I learned that uh, <laughs> you <laughs> didn't have to keep resources super high in your face because otherwise people would come to you and get them. So I try to, to keep them low. <clears throat> Let's see how many I get. None so far. You always start to get uh, here uh, advanced relocators once you get to the the hundred uh, bio caps uh, mark to refresh the the thing here. 
Mm, nothing, nothing. No, come on. <clears throat> nothing. 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 Nah. That will be annoying sometimes. No, I'm not gonna pay 40 for that. Prefer to pay 100. Uh, let's go. <clears throat> Nada. My God. I'm gonna pay 19. Come on. Every time that I'm making a video for you guys, this game is not giving me enough advanced relocators here. So I'm making a fool of myself, showing you how I'm spending bio caps and resources for anything. Out here, I need more wood now. So here, one. <clears throat> Two. Not bad, guys, too. I have a lot of box relocators, but I like to have them because during a state versus state and reservoir rate, I spend a lot, guys. I know some people tell me that you shouldn't be relocating that much. That's what, that's what I like. That's what I do. So you shouldn't be telling other people how to play. Of course, there are some smarter ways to play it, but uh, look, I'm here just to have fun, so. Here, three advanced relocators. I'm gonna pay some 10 bio caps here. Boom, 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 boom. Come on. Well, I also get some speed ups here, guys. So I'm, I, I use those speed up speed ups a lot. So. That even if I don't get advanced for locators, I'm happy with my speed ups because they help me to grow as well. You get like maybe four or five hours every day of speed ups, and those things add up uh, at the end of the day. So I never go past the 500 mark here to refresh, I always stop there. And then today we have the exploration thing for, for Migo. Let's see what I get. I'm gonna explore with you here, guys, as well. So as I told you, in Migo you have two crates during the exploration day. You have the blue ones and the green ones. The most popular and the, are, are the green ones. And of course, uh, you can always get uh, the blue one, but you have to look for them <laughs> a lot. And it takes a lot of time. But if you have the time, guys, you find the blue one and then keep digging on the same spot because those crates they just jump around to the closest spot available and that's always around where you uh, digged before so if you find a blue one just keep digging around on the same spot don't move the same thing applied to the green ones once you find a green crate and you keep digging around this on the same spot you will realize that you always will find green crates so i will go here to dig there are not a lot of people here. Ah, fuck. Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> uh, here. Here. I will relocate here. Let's see. I have 153 advanced relocators, so I will spend one to just dig. I cannot wait. I hate waiting for the marshes. So, let's see. Very far. I think one marsh and then you can say another one while this first dock is digging. So here you go. Boom. So I find one I found one is green. And as I said guys, you have the if you have the time, you can just Keep digging around what you do is just you press here share this on maybe the state chat on your of um you can share that on the state chat or your alliance chat and maybe people will dig for you or you can press give up and you will have to pay 30 stamina and then what you do is just to dig in another place to try to find the blue ones so because i don't want to spend all that time digging around trying to find a blue cray which is difficult for me i've tried before i'm just gonna keep digging around here and if i get just green crates i seriously don't care that much because as i told you guys i'm not like uh trying to rank super goods on this event 
I, before if I have the time maybe but now I don't have so as you see I will always find green ones now because maybe this was the same crate that I caught here but because it's jumping around to the first spot available then I'm just gonna get it here if I keep digging around digging around here on the same spot if I move to another spot maybe I will be lucky and, and get a blue one but uh, I prefer just to keep digging here to use these eight kits that I have to use and come back to the hive and start working because <laughs> the first thing that I do in the morning is to play I should be working first thing in the morning and but when you are addicted to a game what can you do huh? what can you do guys <laughs> so maybe I will speed up this a little bit because it's gonna take a lot of time and nobody wants to see this let's be honest So what I'm digging, I also do my intel, I still do these troop things, if I have the stamina available or is the, there are no special events where like you get a uh, good reward for killing like or rallying infected zombies and stuff. So like hunting hunter and, and, and things like that, I don't use like stamina for these things but when there are not those events. I just use my stamina to complete all my intel to get those troops then you upgrade those troops and those are some extra troops that you have there especially if you are free to play the only defense that you can have is guess what troops but as this game is going crazy maybe <laughs> Those troops won't be, won't be enough to defend and attack from a uh, spender because now you get like new gear and if they could kill like 2 million troops from for uh, with one attack before, if they were maxed out, maybe they can kill now like, I don't know, 2.5, 3 million troops and they send a march of 200 troops. So that's crazy guys. If you see the game and you analyze that, one player, which is max out, can send 200 troops, and if you have like almost 2 million, he can still win the battle. And you lose tons of troops, like tons, because your hospital capacity is not that high, your enlistment capacity is not that high, and when you go to, enl to enlistment, you lose like 30% of your troops. So that player hit you, that player loses like 20k, 30, maximum 50k, and you lose like hundreds of troops. So that's the sad part of the game. That's what I rather be a very high spender or <laughs> not be an spender at all, at all because you can never catch up with the top spenders. Uh, and if you are low, low spenders, you will have fun. You will be stronger than the average player, but still not strong enough to compete with the top guys. And you can still get a smoke super quick, guys. Super, super quick. So how many kids? Five kids left. My God. Guys, I'm gonna shut up and speed up this. So that's it for the digging thing guys, I guess yeah I have zero keys I have to wait so I'm gonna claim all my rewards here, I'm gonna come back to my hive with my guys here close to a trap because today we have a trap so that's it, oh, what, what was, what was this? I'm gonna go to my Migo station, my Migo center here to upgrade some stations. Where is that? Here. So you can have preference here for what you, you upgrade, guys. So you see here, increase Migo, increase Migo info obtained through completing Intel tasks. Um, of course, I wanna increase that to get more information here increase uh, uh, increase through blah 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 
year two. Others can increase, and that's it. And as you know, guys, you don't claim your rewards yet. You wait for the end of the day, so you upgrade uh, as much as you can your stations, and then you increase this percentage here. So let's see how um, much information I have collected, 107,000. So I'm gonna use this to buy plasma cores for the next uh, stage of the uh, state versus state. I'm gonna uh, keep uh, collecting this to buy my gear design and my legendary heroes. So uh, now what I do, well, before logging off, I'm gonna show you here this new event, guys. Uh, well, we also have this one, the Mother's Day. You can claim some rewards here. And boom, you get this uh, sweater of love. <laughs> so you get this and you can exchange that for one of these here. Of course, I could go here for the the seven days skin, uh, March skin. But guys, I want to risk it all because here you get a permanent skin. It's only 2% chance, but I'm a guy who wants to risk it all. So let's see if I get my permanent skin. Boom, nah, speed ups. Boom, nah, speed ups. Boom, nah, speed up. Boom, nah, speed ups. And that's how you lose 40 sweaters of love <laughs> just for the speed ups, guys. Before I was exchanging those for the seven days uh, March skin, but you just get seven days and you don't get the extra benefits for permanent. So I don't want to have a March for seven days. That's good, actually. It was good because state versus state is coming and I'm usually tricking players sending one troop. And if I don't have the skin, they are gonna see that. So I should have paid for the, the seven day skin march, guys. Ah, was my mistake. And you have this gear refinement. Finally, a state of survival giving you some gear material for free. But guess what? They are giving you this for free, which is, uh, which are about. I'm calculating that you are getting maybe maximum 40, 50 tactical gear designs, which is super high. You don't usually get that for free. You only get one free here in the daily store once a month. <laughs> but guess what? They are giving you this because they are releasing the red gear. Usually you have here like different kind of gears. Where is that? Now the maximum we have in our state is this one, the orange here. Now they are releasing four more tiers but of red gear. And you are gonna need around 4,000 tactical gear designs to get that. Without count, counting the, the chief gear material, these uh, tools, the glue and the advanced alloy. So you are gonna need tons of that, thousands and they are giving you just 40 for free. So you have to be grateful, guys. <laughs> and that's it for today, guys. That's the a day in a life of a broke player. What I'm gonna do today is just, oh well, I'm just gonna boost my gathering. I'm gonna send troops to gather. I'm just gonna log out for the day and work a little bit, come back later. So I hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time.